And His Royal Majesty Oba Abdul Wasiu Omogbola on Lawal has said Nigerians should be rest assured that President Tinubu will satisfy the citizenry as he is calling on Nigerians to be patient as a president only just celebrated one year in office. He gave this charge at the celebration of Ijiwa and Legba Festival, which is celebrated alongside his fourth anniversary of his rule. On the importance of the festival, he says it is an opportunity for the Euro Kingdom to take a walk back in time and witness how the sons and daughters of Olofin celebrated their forebearers in time past, appreciating cultural tradition and ancient knowledge. It is symbolic because it is a time set aside annually to offer prayers for peace and prosperity for Iru Kingdom and her indigents and the state and nation at large as the custodian of their rich heritage, culture and tradition. Also, the wife of the former Senate President of the Ninth Assembly, Mrs. Toyin Saraki, speaks on the festival and the state of the nation. In attendance, we are Oba Elegushi, Oba of Mushi, Ijora and other parts of Lagos, as well as other notable dignitaries. It's a trying period, but uh, I, I see lights at the end of the tunnel. A lot of policies, economic policies, fiscal and monetary policies, a lot of uh, fiscal instruments have been deployed to ensure that we have a better economy. Yes, the, the president uh, I will always want the people of Nigerians to give him chance is barely one year in office and I'm sure with all the policies and the project that uh, he has already put in place with his other uh, colleagues or ministers or cabinet or head of MDAs I'm sure we will be able to smile at the end of the day and uh, this festival is very significant to us for the fact that this is a festival for the Olofin children and all of us here we are our descendant is Olofin, and the Elegba festival is to celebrate Olofin, our uh, forebears. Basically, the 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 dead jaws in Lagos and a bit of their worries are uh, the people that are usually celebrating this festival. An amazing four years since His Majesty ascended the throne of his forefathers and foremothers. And ever since he ascended the throne, he has been devoted to the development of Iru Kingdom, to the safety, security, peace, lives and livelihoods of the people here. Today has been a more low-key celebration, but a beautiful celebration full of the Muslim faith. He started the celebration with prayers of thanksgiving. You can never really separate the socio-economic status of Nigerians from what some people would call political will and political capital. At this point in Nigeria's development, with cost of living crisis all over the world in the post-COVID era, it behoves upon us all to do our best to move on. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.